hair looking cute, the hair is looking cute, the face, well. Hey guys, it's Isabel and welcome back to my channel. Once again, I've changed my setup. Probably gonna go back to the original, but for now we're gonna stick with this with the bad lighting and all. Typical me fashion. I'm quite late to the party. I will be reviewing the 2018 Oscars fashion. Unfortunately, Taya is away and will not be joining us. We're gonna start off with um, Emily Blunt. What the hell is she wearing? It's kind of like a love-hate relationship with this because like the skirt's really cute. And then it's got these weird little poofy sleeves and like a night thing. It looks like she's some old wealthy lady in the 1910s in her nightgown. A little bit of luxury, but you know, she's got to go to sleep. I don't know about the little like detailing. I'm just, I'm just not a fan. It's like, oh, skirt's cute, but then I look at the rest of it. <laughs> no. <laughs> I think I'm going to rate it like a 4 out of 10. Meryl Streep. She's just a gorgeous lady. The actual dress, I'm really liking the plunge. She does a good plunge, like that's just, she just does it real well. I like the colour of red. It looks like a weird material. It kind of looks like one of those cheap materials that you find in um, stores. It just kind of looks cheap, just kind of feels cheap, even though it's not cheap. It's just really, really simple. I'm not really a fan of the dress, but of course Meryl pulls it off. A 5 out of 10. I'm not, like, it's like meh. Okay, Hayley Bennett. What the hell is that? It kind of looks like they've gone out and killed an animal, shaved the fur off, and then thrown it onto the dress of, like when it's covered in glue. Oh my god, it's Yzma. They put like glue over there, then they like hit her with pillows and she turns into a chicken. It doesn't really look like that, but that's like the vibes I'm getting. It also kind of looks like they've gone in a pine tree, shaved it, thrown it on, there's a general theme of things being shaved and thrown onto this dress. 1 out of 10. Damn! Molly Sims. That is actually gorgeous. I love the colour and the detailing and it's like sleek and sophisticated. It's got that little extra bit of trailing but it's enough to actually be a little bit of a trailer rather than the little awkward bit of fabric that some people are a fan of. I love that slit. Like I... Oof. It's not too high either. I feel like she could have gone a little bit higher if she wanted to floor a little bit more, but it's kind of like a sophisticated, classy slit rather than a mm -hmm -hmm, look at my leg slit, you got me? I love the plunge. I kind of see through on the sleeves. I really love that. 8 out of 10. Nicole Kidman. I love that blue. It's gorgeous. I like the like neckline. I feel like it could have been a little bit tighter to her body, but that's just my personal opinion. I'm not a fan of the bowie thing. I feel like it's just a bit... Poorly designed. Looks like a last minute detail to try and spruce up the dress. If that wasn't there, I feel like it'd be a gorgeous dress and I'd really, really love it. I don't know. There's like parts I love and then parts I hate. It's just, I think we're gonna go six. Jennifer Lawrence, she is looking gorgeous. I really love that material. It's really cool. And it kind of looks sheer and little see through. I think that's just the material though. I don't think it actually is. I love the little straps. It's just like a little cute little thing and it hugs her body in the right places. It's a little bit weird how it has that little dolphin looking thing. I think that's the only complaint really. Honestly, I don't think I'd like this dress if I saw it on a mannequin, but she's just really pulling it off. 6.5. Gal Gadot. It's like 1920s flapper vibes, which I'm really enjoying. It's a really cool and fun dress, although I'm like, I love it, I hate it, I love it, I hate it. I'm gonna go five because I really don't know if I love it or I hate it, but it's fun and it's cool and it's creative, so I support that. Margot or Robbie, what I can remember of all the clothes she's worn, it just seems very her. I like how sleek it is and how it's kind of like falling onto her body rather than hugging it. The train's okay, it's like meh. These like things I love and hate, I want to hate it but I really like it. I'm gonna go six out of 10. Zendaya, love her. What is she wearing? I gotta say, not many people have worn this color. She really pulls it off. I'm actually a real big fan of that like waterfall look. I was like flowing and then flowing down the other way. It looks really comfy and sophisticated. I really like how it's stitched her waist. It's kind of like a Grecian vibe. I think I'm gonna go a six out of 10 because I do really think she's pulling it off, but it's just kind of not what I'm into. 
Fatima El Rimai. I feel like I have not pronounced that right. I'm really sorry about that. Out of the dresses I've seen so far, this one definitely stands out. She's very refined and sophisticated and I'm actually really loving it. Like the nice little bit of gold. It's not over the top, but it's just right. 7 out of 10. Andra Day. Um, sweetie, let them have cake. So 1700s French vibes. Why did you think it was a good idea to wear this? Kind of looks like they've ripped off a curtain from the 1700s and then bunched it all up, sewed it together a little bit and was like, go, done, art, work, yes. No. 3 out of 10. Oh, Gina Rodriguez. I really hope I said her last time right. She's so beautiful. I think it's my favourite dress of the night. I love the pink, I love the detailing, I love that extra bit around the sides, I love the belt, I love the plunge. I just... Uh, everything about this I love. I think I have to give it a 9.5. Mira Sorvino. I love the little like petals on it and the train's gorgeous and I feel like up here it's kind of a weird cut. If that was fixed it'd be a lot better. I like that it's kind of cinched and then it just flows and it looks like, she looks like a fairy tale princess. 8 out of 10. Alison Janey, oh my god. She's kind of got the Meryl Streep vibes but like sleeker and more sophisticated. I love how it how, like hugs her body and the little, the sleeve trains. That's just gorgeous. Oh my god, what a nice detail. And I like the little plant, the little cut. It's just like, ooh, 8 out of 10. Taraji P. Henson, I know I pronounced that wrong, but damn, oh my god, she looks incredible. I love it. That leg slit is just like, and even like the little sleeves, like, ah, why do I love this so much? I should hate it. It's sleek and sexy and refined and just amazing. 7.5 out of 10. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye! I need that traction. I got. Scoochie, <laughs> scoochie over here, sweetie.